The construction of the offices for the traditional authorities is to allow our traditional leadership a decent space to, pe to perform its functions, power, and duties, as well as to run its administrative affairs. Equally, a community hall is for the community to gather where people of all ages, ethnicity, and socioeconomic status or status or status can meet. So this is very, very important. He used the platform to warn traditional authorities to steer clear of counterproductive activities. I'm disturbed. Now I'm coming. I'm disturbed by disputes within some of our traditional communities that has really reached an alarming rate. And I would like to remind my traditional communities on this day that disputes not or cannot solve problems. And if they are not solved on time, results in conflict, which is costly, derails focus from serving the people disturbs peace and stability in the communities as well. On behalf of the Kunene Governor, Maria Shea, and Geo Daman Traditional Authority Chief, Max Harasep Geises, their representative had this to say. Uh, let's hope they will be able to know what is happening today in Angen and what the Robins are still coming through to Angen, where we have a community hall today where we are going to have our event. And uh, the third thing we also get to have now their office where they are going to operate their matters pertaining to community development and uh, to resolve community conflict among themselves. Yes, many traditional authorities are to, today without offices. We count ourselves lucky to celebrate this milestone and opening and unveiling our traditional office which is a fulfilling task by our government. New coming and new operational methods in form of an office where culture can be celebrated. Culture being one of our main Objective. The building was constructed with government's financial support, which Utoni described as a means to bridge the gap between communities and promote inclusivity, diversity and intergenerational connections.